Hi guys, this is Virag from Bionic Buzz and tonight I feel very honored because we are here in Los Angeles downtown in this red carpet. What is unusual in uh, the new wave of the pandemic, most of the Hollywood events are cancelled. So uh, yes, we are very excited, not just because of the circumstances, but because of the movie. What we're going to see tonight is the night shade and um, we are looking forward to talk to some stars on the red carpet. Stay with us and stay healthy. My name is Casey Crabill and I'm the owner of Blue Bowtie Productions. Could you share something about it? Sure. Actually, one of the producers, Jamie Gallagher, sent me the script and she said, hey, I, th I think this is something you might be interested in. And uh, when I read the script, I couldn't put it down. So she said, hey, why don't I introduce you to Landon and Sarah, the writers, and the director, obviously. And um, we had a conversation and, and decided that we were going <laughs> to make this film. I mean, they, they already had it in their mind, but I wanted to come and help uh, enhance it. Did you uh, immediately had a passion to uh, producing a thriller movie? I'm sorry? Say to producing a thriller, because it's a, it's a very specific uh, type of movie, so... Yeah, I mean, I never look at anything as a risk. If, it, if there's a project that I'm passionate about, um, th then I like to see it get made. Whether it's a, a feature film, a television show, or, or a reality TV show, I look for projects that I'm passionate about, that, uh, that I want to bring to life, that I want to tell the story about. Uh, what is the next project you're working on? What is the next what you're going to produce? Well, I, obviously there's a lot that you can't talk about when it comes to development, but there are I do have uh, multiple uh, films and television shows in development with various networks um, and, uh, and studios, so we'll just have to wait and see. Are you working with big studios or uh, you are producing uh, like uh, independent projects? I do both. I do both. Uh, yeah, I've, I've done all side of it from independent film to studio film to uh, studio television. So um, there's, again, if I find something that I connect with, material that I connect with, that I feel passionate about, that's what I want to see made. What was in your career, what was the smaller project that you produced and what was the biggest one? <laughs> What's the biggest one? Oh, I don't... I don't want to make that comparison because, in my, you know, they're all big to me. It's, I don't look at any project as small because making anything come to life on screen is a tremendous undertaking, whether it's a, a short, low-budget film or a student film to, to uh, you know, a $100 million studio movie. They all take the stars to align to get made and the right team of people. 